We'll guide you through how to disable and remove the login password on Windows 11 PC or laptop. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. So this can make it much more convenient to get into your computer as you don't need to enter any password. Do just remember though, this is really putting your data at risk because this means anybody can go onto your computer and start using it, going through your data and files. So do just consider that, that it can go and basically remove a layer of protection from your computer. Still though, if you're sure you want to go ahead, what we need to do is go ahead to the bottom of your computer and you need to go and press on the Windows Start button like so. Then you want to come up here and you need to go and find the option for settings and we can go and click on it. Next, you want to come over to the left and you need to go and find the option for accounts just here. Now, what you need to do is go and look at the top here. So to go and do this, we need to be using a local account. If you're currently using a Microsoft account, you'll go and see your email here. This means we cannot go and remove the password. We'll need to go and first of all, go and make the Microsoft account into a local account. So to go and do that, you need to go and scroll down to your info and account settings. If it says Microsoft account, then what you can do is you'll find the option for sign in with a local account instead. You can go and see I have the option sign in with a Microsoft account instead as I'm already, I'm already using that local account. So once you've gone and switched, it's a really easy process. You just need to go and create a local account. You choose a name and then you go and enter in your password you want to use. Then we can come back here and what you then need to do is scroll down and you want to go and find sign in options in account settings. And what you can then do is you need to go down and you need to go and find the option for password. It says sign with your account's password, click on it. Then it'll go and say the option for change, which we can click on. Don't worry, we're not changing it. We're going to be removing it. Here you can then go and enter in the current password you used to get into your computer with. And now it's asking us for a new one. But of course, we don't want to have one. We want to go and have this blank. So in order to go and do this, all you need to do is you don't enter in anything. Keep it blank. And all you need to do is at the bottom is you can go and press next like so. And as you can see, it says next time you sign in, use your new password. Go and press finish. And that's it. Now you don't have a password on your account. We'll go and say changing and it goes and says add here. So you can add one if you want. But the next we go and log in, literally all you need to do is go and press sign in. There's a button when you start your computer and you'll then be on your computer and have access to everything. As I said, there is a security risk here, but if you're sure that's what you want to do, that's how it can be done. If you found this useful or want to see more, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. I look forward to helping you again in the future with more useful guides. Have a great day and thank you so much for watching. Goodbye for now.